ever thought of how to cool down a few drinks while out camping without a refrigerator? Well, we have just a solution for that. My name is Senosha Mahavu. And I am Uwe Chinazina. This video presents the modeling and matching of PV and Peltier cells for solar cooling applications. In layman's terms, that is simply a solar-powered mini-fridge that operates on Peltier cells technology as compared to the traditional compressor-based refrigerator. Peltier cells are unique semiconducting devices made of two conductive surface plates. When a voltage is applied across a Peltier device and current flows through it, there is heat absorption from one plate leaving it very cold while transferring that heat to the other plate making it very hot. The main application of this effect is cooling, which is what we are interested in. However, they can also be used for heating. The primary advantage of Peltier cells as cooling devices is that they are feasible to do small cooling jobs, like personal coolers that run off of 12 volts, one which would be impractical with compressor-based systems. They do not require any refrigerants, which may be harmful to the environment. They are noiseless, economical, and have simple control where cooling can be achieved with no mechanical moving parts. Despite their practical application in smaller jobs, Peltier cells are less efficient unlike their compressor unit's counterparts. This is due to heating effects of currents which create a temperature gradient between the Peltier surfaces, hence requiring the provision of heat sinks to counter the heating effect. Our design therefore considers heat sinks to dissipate heat on the hot side to prevent overheating, reduce lifespan and ultimate failure over time. This also ensures optimal cooling because if heat from the hot side starts traveling back to the cold side, cooling performance drops. Our design also considered and tested two cooling methods for the heat sinks. Firstly, a heat sink cooled by cold water and secondly, ambient air circulated by fans. With a heat sink and a fan, the Peltier achieved a minimum average temperature of 7.9 degrees Celsius in 3 minutes while driven at an input voltage varied up to 14.5 volts. While a heat sink in water achieves better cooling performance, this method leads to poor results once the water warms up due to no continuous flow of fresh cold water, hence allowing heat to move from the hot side back to the cold side, where else fans have constant continuous air cooling effect. Testing with a DC bench power supply and a PV panel displayed a linear relationship between the current and voltage of the Peltier. However, the voltage showed logarithmic and exponential relationships with the cold side temperature and temperature gradient respectively. To demonstrate this cooling application, a mini fridge prototype was constructed using styrofoam for good insulation and an aluminum sheet inside for better heat transfer from inside to the outside 